Now, I don't know if you guys saw the, the post there. There was an article that was posted in the Daily Sun where Lillian Dubé, uh, the veteran actor, is warning celebrities and the new kinds coming up. And she's warning particularly for a certain reason. She says they should be careful of actually the pride of fame when you're coming up. And I thought that was quite an interesting one because looking at this day and age where anybody can be celebrity, in a day and age where anybody can prop themselves up to a position where they are practically in everybody's eyes. And I thought it was quite an interesting one for us to see it in this day and age where everybody can be a celebrity or anybody is a celebrity. And I thought the reason why I wanted to talk about it now was to be careful of the responsibility of celebrity. There's a huge responsibility, and unfortunately, for some people, they are not pretty much aware of it. They just kind of like treat it or hang around it as if there is nothing going on over them. And I wanted to bring back this channel, the second channel, particularly with that topic. If you guys had seen the article, if you haven't, please go read it. If you're a content creator, please go read it. And be careful of what happens after the cameras go off. Because after the cameras go off, there is the pride that comes with it. There is the pride that sticks out because you feel a certain way. You feel like other people are trying to do what you're doing. And now that you are doing it, you start feeling a certain way. You start feeling, you start having certain types of feelings that you attribute as weakness for other people. You kind of take that on. And instead of it being a good thing for you, it becomes a very negative thing. And I thought that's such an interesting perspective to have. The article is on the Daily Sun. You can go take a read at it. I thought it was quite an interesting one and I wanted to talk about it here. And I've talked about this with the responsibility of what we are now finding ourselves into and us as social media influencers and everybody else. Be careful of what happens when the, when the mics go off. When the cameras go off, when the lights go off, and I'm, I might be saying lights go off because I'm about to get load shaded. <laughs> but be careful of what happens when the cameras go off. That pride, that thing of feeling like, yes, I've achieved what others couldn't, so you start feeling a certain way about yourself or something like that. Be very careful. Anybody can catch that, but don't catch feelings for other people. Yeah, I did it because others couldn't do it and what. You know, like it starts piling up this pride in you. You did it. Attribute that to the grace of God for you. It doesn't mean others are weak, that they haven't done what you're doing. It just means God has had grace and has given you a position of privilege. It's a, privilege. it's a privileged position. I see what we do here with the days of social media as a privilege to be able to represent other people, to be able to communicate to people. I don't take it lightly sitting here. I take it as serious. I wake up exactly the time when you guys wake up going to work and I sit up to get my mind in right to represent the thoughts that I am here to represent in their full extent. And if I'm wrong, I'll come back and say, you know what, that was a wrong perspective. I shouldn't have held it that way and I shouldn't have stuck out my thoughts in that particular way in, or in that direction. And I'm open for correction. But if it's a doctrine I met, we might discuss it with scriptures involved and all that kind of stuff. But I thought that article was quite an interesting one in the day and age when everybody is a celebrity. And my light said, sorry, Chief, we have to go off. But this channel is back up. I will see you guys on the next episode. Don't worry. Yeah, I'll be good.